Good morning, guys. It is Saturday the 3rd. It is 4.30 in the morning, and this is Matt in the Man Cave. How are you doing? Or, it's just Matt. Hey, guys, I'm reading Romans chapter 4. Listen to this. This is such a good word, and I love it. Blessed are they whose iniquities are forgiven and whose sins are covered. Blessed is the man to whom the Lord will not impute sin. Have you ever seen those ducks at the lake, guys? And you see them, maybe you're feeding them bread. We used to get a whole loaf of cheap Wonder Bread and feed the ducks. The ducks loved Wonder Bread. We used to hate Wonder Bread because it was so cheap and yucky. But they would just eat that bread. But, you know, one of the things they would do is they would go under the water or they would fly and get under the water. And when they came up, they would shake all that water off of them. It was crazy watching them shake, especially if they were shaking anywhere near you because you were going to get wet. It's the same here. Blessed is the man to whom the Lord will not impute sin. It doesn't stick. You may do it. You may repent of it, but it doesn't stay with you. It doesn't stay on you. When your father sees you, he sees you through the imputed righteousness of the son. And so what does that make you? It makes you blessed. You're absolutely blessed. Blessed are they whose iniquities are forgiven and whose sins have been covered. Your sins have been covered by the blood of the Lamb. You've been given imputed righteousness. You've been given a second chance, a third chance, a fourth chance, a fifth chance. I mean, it just doesn't get any better than being forgiven by God, being a child of God, being born again by God. Remember, initially you weren't seeking out God. God sought you out, saved you. And if you look at your life, you can see all the blessings. You can see a roadmap of Ebenezer's of what he has done for you and continues to do for you. Uh, don't take your eyes off the king. He has your back. I love you guys. Peace out. Have a great Saturday.